where fine spirits meet. And today I have another single malt on my cask. Roop. Yeah, it's not a Scotch single malt, it's an American single malt. And let's have a look what they are calling themselves. Balcones, Texas single malt. 53% ABV of the original Texas spirit malt spirit. So, in America, the distilling of single malt whiskey is not so restricted. And it's not that well known because it's just not customary to do a single malt in America. Oh wait, let me show you the bottle. Wait, where's the front here? It's the front. Nice. Uh, ah, yeah. Very nice bottle. So the guys at Balcones do a really nice bottle plus single malt. And yeah, usually you can do other kind of grain except barley. You can also do continuous distillation. But the guys at um, Balcones, they really do it by the books. They do it with pot stills from the Scottish, um, yeah, Coppersmith Forsyth. And uh, I think they also do only malt and I'm not quite sure about only um, um, barley malt. But as you have a look at it, um, it looks like they do fresh American oak cast. That's just very customary in America and you rarely get any whiskey that has been matured in used cask. It's just, I don't know, it's just the American way to, to mature them in yeah, new casks. Whereas the Scottish, they are a bit more price sensitive <laughs> and they do used casks. So, um, unfortunately, it doesn't carry an age statement. Um, and as it's an American malt, you don't have to have three years. So this could actually be uh, less than three years. Wait, wait, what does it say? Batch SM20-1, date 42120. Ah, oh, that's the American way of writing on, on a date. So it's the 21st of April 2020. But I think that's when the, the, the bottle has been filled and not the cask has been filled. So let's have a look how a Texas single malt, how that performs. Mm -hmm. 53% ABV, yeah, that's what I wanted to say. You have a little bit of an alcoholic note, but that's that can be normal for cask strength. And it's very, very round and very, very caramel flavored very 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 sweet it really feels like a a bourbon but it does have it does have an, a different undertone where you have that popcorn vanilla undertone with the bourbon that's now well, the vanilla is there a little bit but it's it's a little bit different it's very similar but not quite the same Mmm. 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 Oh, full flavored. The American white oak just hits you, tells you, yes, American white oak. Mmm. It's it's a a strange way of having a a mild and a bit more sophisticated bourbon. The the oak just reminds you so much of the bourbon. The, that oak is such a big part of the bourbon um, flavor that is very similar to the, the single malt here from Texas. Um, but the the base ingredient, the spirit made from barley, is just so different. So you always wonder, is that really a bourbon? No, it's not really a bourbon. It's not a single malt, a Scotch single malt either. So I like it. It does have a, a sense of um, caramelized or brown butter, like uh, heated butter and 
uh, a little bit of a, a fried smell going on and a lot of caramel, a little bit of fruitiness, but the fruitiness is candied fruitiness or very, a very, very, very sugary fruitiness. Mm. 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 <laughs> mm. Whoa. Mm. Maple sugar, sugar, maple syrup, that's what I want to say, not maple sugar, maple syrup. Mm. And has that little bit of a phenolic touch to it, a little bit of a um, a dry smokiness, but only very, very in the back. The, the foreground is just so filled with sweetness and oak and mm, yeah, caramel. Ah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, mm, I like it. But it's it's quite forward. It's quite strong. It's quite intense. So it's a. Uh, it feels like a little bit of a, an older bourbon, jazzed up version, more smooth and oaky, and mm, and it doesn't have these sticky overtones of the most bourbon that you can try. A sticky sweet overtones. So it's really nice alternative to a bourbon. Compared to a Scotch single malt, it's just way off to the, yeah, sweetness of the yeah, bourbon style sweetness. Mm -hmm. I like it. <laughs> it's 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 a fun whiskey, and I like to enjoy it. Yeah, <laughs> that was it. Thank you very much for watching, and see you next time.